Hello ladies and gentlemen, MarauderX here back with more Let's Play Shining Force 3 Scenario 3. And we are here in... Uh, the battle is called Monsters Hidden in the Darkness. We're in Maya Village, and uh, the village flies away at night because monsters attack. There's a lot of monsters right over there, and they're kind of in our way. And then we've got... We've got a big, big town that we need to deal with, and the boss hasn't even shown up yet. So, what we need to do is, we need to send someone over here to get this barrel. Uh, probably gonna be Honesty. I need to send someone over who can fly, because we have to send someone who can sneak over this way without triggering an enemy, because apparently an enemy will want to attack that barrel and destroy it, which causes us to lose the treasure. So, we want to send someone to sneakily get over there and deal with that. Meantime, we have a huge group of enemies that are kind of in the way. So let's take a look and see what we've got right here. And this is not all that's going to show up. We have new enemies. The Sandworms. HP of 75, movement of 4, attack of 67, defense of 42, agility of 17, luck of 3. Sandworms do have a sleep attack. And as such, they are going to drop an antidote herb to help cure said sleep attack. So that's... That's good, isn't it? Cerberus. HP of 75, movement of 6, attack of 68, defense of 48, agility of 24, luck of 4. Cerberus also has fire breath, so, you know, just a heavy damage attack. And as such, can drop a healing drop. That's always good to have. Hydras are back for more. HP of 70, movement of 4, attack of 65, defense of 42, agility of 16, luck of 2. As always, they have acid breath and can drop a healing drop. New to the group, we've got Blue Dragon. HP of 120, movement of 6, attack of 68, defense of 48, agility of 20, luck of 5. Blue Dragons have a Blizzard Breath attack, and, well, they can also drop, for whatever reason, a Freeze Orb, because that makes perfect sense why they're carrying a Freeze Orb. So, we can kill him and get a new Dragon on our team. That's kind of what I want to aim for. I want to get... Uh, I want to replace our Green Dragon friend, because he has well beyond outlived his usefulness. And then the boss is going to show up, and he's going to show up somewhere in... Oh, no, he's over here! Okay, fantastic! So let's take a look here. We've got Hell Succubus, uh, HP of 60, MP of 50, movement of 6, attack of 60, defense of 44, agility of 33, luck of 5, freeze 3, and can drop fairy powder, which is weird because they don't have a special attack. So, And then the boss of the fight is a skullfish, because that makes perfect sense, a floating fish with this random group of enemies. HP of 98, Movement of 5, attack of 70, defense of 50, agility of 17, luck of 2. He has a critical hit, as just a critical hit, and drops a healing drop. So, not really anything to be all of that threatened by. Like I said, we've got treasures to deal with. We've got small mithril in that barrel over here. And then we've got, I believe it's this barrel, has a quick chicken. We want both of these. So let's get to it. Bridget, we're gonna just kind of send you out here. Roly, the unicorn, you're gonna kind of just come out. These guys are, go and we also have enemies that will pop up. So we've got two hydras that'll pop up because there are five in. Yeah, there's five in that group. So two more will spawn elsewhere in the fight. Five more Cerberus four more sandworms, two more blue dragons, and four hell succubi. So, that's a lot of enemies. I don't think they will com continue to respawn, because that's a lot of enemies. But, that gives you an idea of what we are up against numbers-wise. So, it would actually very much behoove us to take out as many of, uh as many of the enemies out as possible, as quickly as possible. So I'm going to be relying on <coughs> AoE spells. Uh, lots and lots of AoE spells. So, 
All right, let's get thousand or uh, Cyclops up here because I I really need Cyclops to to join in. I want him to take out one of the the blue dragons that spawn. We only have one available at the moment, so. But if I could get if I could get them, and I'll probably send the green dragon to his death. Uh, simply f for that purpose, really, so that I could try to get all three of the blue dragons. Because um, again, the green dragon has has reached his usefulness. He's 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 served me well, but I I, I don't I don't need. I don't need him anymore. And if we're gonna go for, you know, useful... Oh, you think you're cute. You're gonna try to flank me. Oh. Oh, that's your that's your plan, is it? Okay, well. Come on. Group up. Alright, um... Speaking of sending the green dragon to his death, because yeah, 12 damage, that's not, not useful anymore. And more sandworms, and hell succubi, oh goody, hell succubi is my next target, because you have freeze three. Nope, we are, yeah, we're gonna aim for that group, because screw you guys. I, I am not a fan of whatever BS you guys are having trying to trying to pop up and flank me. All right, lot of damage there. Roly, take out the Hell Succubus. She does not need to live. And Roly taking out the Hell Succubus, not needing to live. Stampede's kind of a a very dark special attack. Like, Rolly's gonna run up, impale you on the horn, launch you into the air, and then horse kick you. That's... that's kind of rough. Alright. Um... Let's, let's focus on killing some things, rather than letting them survive. To me that that sounds like a, a, a noble endeavor. I don't I don't want lots of enemies that are half dead. I want a few dead enemies and a few alive enemies. <sighs> Except I can't even accomplish that because Zephyrus not quite strong enough. Alright, um I wanna keep her out of the way. Without inadvertently, you know, popping up any, uh... Any new friends. Alright. Really? Thank you, Prodon. Heatwave was not necessary to take out the Sandworm with 3 HP. Alright, Prodon's 18... This is gonna be a fun fight to level up in, too, because... I... I am... I'm at a point where level ups are gonna be fun. Alright, um... Who is more of a threat? I think the Sandworm? I'm thinking the Sandworm. The defense down can be rough, but I can still take actions. And Julian is level 19. I really don't think Julian needs to be 19. Caring too much, what would we drop for the Antidote Herb? Um, n nothing at the moment. All right, who do I have strength advantage against? Oh, right! Everything. Uh, 75 versus 70. Well, that's, f well, 58. Let's, I c I'm pretty sure I could kill you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're dead. You might be alive. Fair nope, no. That was, that was a lot of no. 58 exactly. Well then. Um... I, I could go for... 
Well, actually, let's, let's do this. This... This will work. It's a little expensive, but we also get the magic bonus from, uh... From Bridget. It won't kill the, the surfers, but it'll put a world of hurt on them. I was really hoping to be able to hit more than one person with it, but looking at it, it's like... The enemies really aren't spreading out. Or, uh, they're not, you know... Aligning themselves in, in good ways. So... I, I've gotta... Take what I can get. And Dragon Rush, I'm pretty sure the Cerberus is dead. Or very close to it. But Cyclops levels to 18 in the process. Feel his Dragon Rush of Fury. Alright. Again, people who need to, to be dead. Oh crap, she still has a mace. I forgot she still has a mace. I was wondering why her agility or her turn order seemed really low. It's because I stopped. I, I had the mace equipped on her. <laughs> I need to fix that. Alright. Now they're going to go on the offensive. Ouch. Okay. Don't go too on the offensive, guys. Alright. Uh, I don't think we've attacked him yet. No, we haven't. And I can't reach the other one. Let's see. Again, 70 versus 75, and I get a bonus against either, so it really doesn't matter. Breath Geyser is gonna hurt. It's not gonna kill him, but it's gonna hurt. And... You're dead! So very dead. Alright, Blue Dragon is starting to move towards us. Skullfish is really just going to kind of hang out there until we start really making an effort to, to get close to him. So... Yes, attack Julian. Alright, that actually does kind of suck, because I have to... I gotta heal. But... Oh, someone's atta you're attacking the green dragon! That's, that's fine, I guess. I mean... I'm not terribly worried about it, because, you know... That, I'm a little more worried about. That Hydra did a lot of damage to Thousand. Thousand really does not have a lot of, uh... A lot of defense. Fire Breath, a green dragon! Trying to prove to me that he is worth keeping. He is not worth keeping. I'm so sorry, Green Dragon. I really am. I feel I feel terrible. I, I really do. And what can I do to kind of alleviate that feeling? Um Eight versus eight. Uh, what has higher power? I'm pretty sure it's Phoenix. Uh, power of 32 versus power of 4. Yeah, so... And I do have the Wendigo... Um... Uh, it's not a raw... It's not a wand, though, is it? That's... No, it is a wand! So I do, ha I do have access to Wendigo. Should I want to give her that? And in fact, um, that's going to change her stats, isn't it? It's going to lower my attack, but raise my defense. At this point, a little bit extra defense is probably going to be a good thing. What about Wendigo? What is that stat? 32 versus 43, but it's 10 MP versus 8. So that's a little... a little bit more rough. But I can I can also do it more often. So... Let's start... Uh, throwing this at the Hydra. 
Hail Hydra. And Fail Nobra. 54 damage. That's that's actually quite quite nice. Alright. Roll A. Yeah, let's let's just do that. Unicorn Ray killing the Hydra. Mostly because Rolly just leveled up, so I know Rolly can still play a little bit of catch up and be fine. So those Hellas Occupy are going to be a major pain in the ass. All right, let's heal. And I'm going to just have to live with the agility down and the the defense down until it wears off. Because more than likely, I'm not going to get too much use out of it. All right. Um... <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I forgot. Slow 2 has a ridiculous range. We're just going to slow everything. Oh, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do this just to prepare. No, no. I was expecting to have to, to pick and shoot. Nope. Everyone gets it. All right, I cannot... I cannot stand over the, the hole there. So I'm hoping... This section here... What... Actually, what does Honesty have? Do you have... You're gonna have to drop something. You're gonna have to drop the healing drop. This is why I don't carry tons of items on people. Like, I... I I'm running out of space. The small mithril is more than worth it because I can craft something that's worth way more than the, uh... The healing drop. But... What will you drop for the small mithril? I will drop the healing drop. Alright, that did not trigger anyone else to show up. So. Um. Who's level what? Gracie is still 17. Gracie's gonna be real hard to get caught up. Like, I'm gonna just have to, like. Save all of his MP for kill strikes. Alright, let's let's do some damage. Dragon Rush. And enough to take out the Cerberus. And Kate, you are not gonna kill that. You're gonna do some damage to that one. Dragon Snipe. Because I kind of figured she was going to one-shot someone, because that's what Kate does nowadays. It's... She she murders things. Alright, uh, Gracia. Another... I mean, I wish that didn't take all of my MP. Really wish it didn't take all of my MP. Let's, let's go ahead and just get the kill. It's fine. I've got enough for one aura on Gracia. That'll help. I need to cast the attack spell on, on Gracia and just see if doing damage to people will help. 39 damage. And only 23 XP, because the Hydra is... not that much of a threat at the moment. Alright, um... I need to equip the better weapon on Spiriel. There we go. That'll help out just a little bit. Does that get a bonus against any? Not against you. Probably not against you either. No. And definitely not against the Hydra, because if it was against the Cerberus, it'd be against the Hydra as well. Alright, so, let's not overextend, but let's do some damage to the Blue Dragon so that we can have Cyclops run in and kill him, so that we can get a new friend on our team. Because our blue dragon, or our green dragon is dead. I'm so sorry, green dragon. 53 damage. The, the Cerberus's flame breath is 
way better than our, the green dragons. That was actually very painful. All right, and this is also going to be very painful. Ouch, that hurt. Okay, Thousand's turn. I'm actually going to go ahead and end this episode here, because we are about out of time. I need to heal Spiriel. I need to do some more damage to a lot of these enemies. And then we need to get the other treasure. And not doing too bad. So I think we can finish up this fight in the next episode. So uh, till then, later, everyone.